MLS stands for mixed liquor suspended solids. It is a measurement used in wastewater treatment to determine the concentration of suspended solids in the mixed liquor. The mixed liquor refers to the mixture of wastewater and activated sludge in an activated sludge process. The MLS's concentration is typically expressed in milligrams per liter (mg/l) or parts per million (ppm). It represents the total amount of solids, both organic and inorganic, that are suspended in the mixed liquor. These solids include microorganisms, inert particles, and any other suspended materials present in the wastewater. By monitoring and adjusting MLSS levels, operators can optimize the treatment process, ensure efficient removal of pollutants, and maintain consistent treatment performance. Settling characteristics. The settling characteristics of the mixed liquor are crucial for effective solid separation in secondary clarifiers. MLSS concentration influences the size and settling velocity of the sludge flocks formed by the microorganisms. Monitoring MLSS helps operators assess the settling characteristics and adjust the process if necessary to prevent solids carryover in the treated effluent. Biomass management. MLSS concentration is used to manage the biomass or microbial population in the treatment process. It helps operators determine the appropriate sludge wasting rate, which is the removal of excess activated sludge to maintain a healthy and balanced microbial population. Process troubleshooting. MLSS measurements can help identify and troubleshoot occasional issues in the treatment plan. Sudden changes or deviations in MLSS concentration may indicate problems such as post flood setting, biological upsets, hydraulic overloading, or toxic influent conditions. It's important to note that MLSS is distinct from MLBSS, mixed liquor volatile suspended solids, which specifically refers to the concentration of volatile suspended solids in the mixed liquor. MLBSS represents the portion of MLSS that is composed of organic, biodegradable material and is commonly used to estimate the active biomass concentration in the treatment process.